Last episode on Psycho Fractions. So I won the fight. I was like, what just happened? His head is worth 79,000. 79 breaking thousand. I'm gonna count down for three. Three. Two. One. Great. Key. And go. All right. Boom. Ah! No. 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 Ah! That's what is going on? My name is Josh, and welcome to a brand new episode of Psycho Factions. This is episode number five. I hope you did your excited for this one. I think it's going to be a little shorter than usual. I'll be honest with you guys, I've been up for freaking <laughs> ages. I've been grinding these videos out, but I have to preface this video right now to tell you that June is going to be an exciting month. Uh, <laughs> best way I can put it is there's going to be a lot of videos coming out. Just take it like that. <laughs> I think I'll also add right now, just to, uh, just to whet your appetite, Psycho, as you know before, it was like two, two episodes per week about, right now, I made the decision, we're going Psycho Daily, yes, that is happening, but yeah, so Psycho is going to be coming out every single friggin' day for the month of June, so from, uh, well, from today, June 1st to June 31st, I hope there is a 31st of June, I feel like there is, but <laughs> if there's not, if there's not, I'm sorry, I meant 30th. So, the plan for today's episode is, uh, well, first thing we gotta do this intro, which I'm doing right now, then... Ah, holy crate key! Last episode, obviously we got the bedrock. <laughs> first time try, because I'm such a jammy banana. Then, I'll take you around the base and, uh, explain what's happened over the past couple days and weeks with, uh, with the faction, because... Well, to be honest with you, quite a lot's gone on. Then, the big thing, we are gonna be building a little compact cow and pig farm, and it's gonna be pretty cool. I think it's time we started making some more money. I am not that rich. Uh, well, I mean, 125k, it's not that bad. It's, it's pretty good. There's, I, you know, I got a lot of money, but I wanna have more money. Oh, I haven't checked the bell top, actually, so we'll take a look. Oh, okay. Well, that was probably a terrible idea. Well, we'll just wait while, uh, while the server uh, orders those 50,000 people. <laughs> Oh, and they're player files. All right, so probably shouldn't have done that. That was maybe a terrible idea. But what is next after this? The holy crate key. So we are going to go to the warp crates. Guys, hit like right now before we do it. Before we, oh, it worked. 1.9 mil. All right, not too bad. That is what you, Yeah, yeah, 1.9 mil. All right. So uh, we, I mean, we got 100. We're like 10 times below that. <laughs> We got a long way to go, but guys, right now, I want you to hit the like button before we go and do this super key, because I think maybe, maybe that will help my luck. Who knows? <laughs> also, before you hit that like button, pray to little Lord Terrio. It worked last time. It's going to work this time, too. <laughs> All right, guys. So I just dropped my friggin' sword. Did I? Oh, no. There it is. Found it. But with that, my name is Josh, and I will see you at friggin' warp crates. Let's hope. Imagine, imagine two bedrock in a row, or a rank. <laughs> I don't think it's going to happen. I'm pretty sure we'll get, uh, my guess is a uh, prop four chest. But maybe, who knows, maybe the, 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 the luck of Lil Lord Terrio up there will help us. Hey, dude, you're flying all over the place. Anyway, so I will see you there. Thanks for watching so far. And uh, yeah, let's go open this friggin' crate, baby. All right, guys, here we friggin' are. We're at the crate. We're at warp crates. We got some guys here. Friggin' shout outs to everybody here, right here. These awesome people are. <laughs> Dude, I'm so hyped. All right, so we have to go three. I think. Oh, no, wait. Wait. Gotta, gotta pray to Lil Lord Terrio first. Then. <laughs> three. <laughs> Two. One. Great key. I go! Okay! Three, two, one! Don't! Oh, what'd I get? I don't know! <laughs> oh, I got a friggin' diamond sword. Alright, guys, so we got a friggin' sharpness three fire aspect two sword. <laughs> you can't win them all. Anyways, GG to the crate. Um, we are. Let me find out what's next. Alright, cool. So, uh, right now, I'm gonna go uh, update you guys on what's happened with the faction and take you around the new base and stuff like that. So, with that said. My name is Josh, and uh, I'll see you there. 
Okay guys, so clearly, as you can see, we have sized things down. <laughs> So before we had the giant obsidian box and all that stuff and the chunks being mined out, what happened was we actually got inside it. We got freaking inside it. Sorry, I gotta move my mic. So to explain what happened, uh, a guy called Spartus Warrior, who he seemed like an awesome dude, but I guess he is he's quite a sneaky fella indeed. But this guy, yeah, I'm not gonna show you that description. It seems like there's a lot of inappropriate stuff in this faction, so <laughs> we'll scroll down as quickly as we can. But, he incited us, uh, good game, honestly, I t <laughs> he totally caught me off guard, so, um, obviously sworn enemies now, not, not in real life, but just in the faction's world. So Spartus Warrior, we are coming for you, we are coming for you. Also, shout outs to, uh, Solar System 67, freaking awesome dude, you watch the videos and stuff, so, uh, yeah, just thanks for being awesome, and thanks to everybody who has, uh, supported the series so far. We are hitting like almost 100 likes on every single episode so far, so I'm super freaking thankful for that, that's insane. So anyways, we have this brand new base, which uh, I guess um, me and me and Hugh is still, well, not me, I say that like I did this, I didn't do any of this, this was all Hugh, so. <laughs> but uh, Hugh built this base, and uh, this is just a little, it's, I mean it's claimed, so. But uh, the way it will work is obviously there will be chests out here, and then with uh, all sorts of enchantment tables to defend from withers, and we're under the ocean. <laughs> It's all quite complicated to explain, but uh, no, it's pretty cool. So uh, also, I kicked a couple people out of the faction. I should probably show you the list now. So uh, I kicked the people whose power was down. There's still seemingly quite a few people with with low power. But also talking to the faction, I will be putting a recruitment thread up at some point. I just don't know when I'm going to do it. Ideally, I wanted to have it done for today, but uh, I'm not sure whether I'll be able to do that because I have to edit this video pretty quick. I have to do it before eight, and it's like five p.m. So. <laughs> Anyway, so now that you guys are updated on what's what's uh, what's happening in the Banana Army faction's psycho world, we can get on to the next thing, which is the Compact Cow Spawner Farm. And so, uh, yeah, we're gonna get to work on that, so uh, I'll see you over at, uh, at the farm. Alright guys, so here we are at the, well, I say the farm like it's actually done, but it's just kind of a mined out area at the moment. But at the end of this episode, we will have a cow and pig farm right here. So the way that we're going to be doing this is, uh, is this a design of my own, which I will be, uh, I recorded a tutorial for this probably like a month ago now. I was meant to upload it a month ago, but I didn't, and I'm sorry, but <laughs> uh, that video will be coming out, I think, tomorrow, maybe the day after. I'm not sure, I have to check my schedule before I say anything. I'm pretty sure Wednesday, but when that video comes out, you guys will get an in-depth tutorial on how to build this. So I'm not going to go too in-depth now. I'd just rather this be shorter so I can get it edited, get it out, get it done, and then uh, we can do a longer episode tomorrow. So uh, I'll take you guys through how we're going to do this. We've got eight spawners, uh, eight of pretty much everything. So uh, we'll have two spawners here, two spawners there, two spawners there, and uh, two spawners there, I guess. I think that's right. <laughs> Then what will happen is they'll spawn on the grass, and uh, then on top of the grass there'll be pressure plates. They get pushed off into the lava, they die, it's very tragic and traumatic and all sorts, but... <laughs> then we can just sell everything that ends up in the chests and stuff, and uh, we shall become slowly more rich. Now the good thing about this design, not only is it compact, but also you can just stack up layers, so uh, if need be... Uh, I can continue stacking this thing up, you know, I believe each layer is four blocks high, and so on those four blocks, it's four blocks by eight blocks by eight blocks, I think. But uh, each layer, you get eight extra spawners, so that's, I mean, it's pretty compact, I'll tell you that, I'll tell you that. But anyways, now you guys understand the gist of this, I am going to get to work and start, uh, well, figure, figuring things out, planning it out, and uh, getting the basics done. So uh, once I've got some progress done, I'll see you guys then. Alright guys, so uh, I've done some work on the on the spawner farm here, and uh, just to take you through the way that this works, there's eight cow spawners under each one of these sets of uh, repeaters over here. What happens is, when it's light, the uh, the cows will spawn on the grass, and then, uh, actually I should put that back. But the cows will end up spawning on the grass, which is also where the, uh, the pressure plates are. When you stand on that, it uh, pushes you out the piston, and then, uh, well, you get pushed into the into the hole, which is usually here. No, we should be fine. I think I'm gonna do this myself. All right, just gotta be super careful. Oi, okay. Now, we have to find a way out of here without disturbing the cows. Will this be fine? This is okay. I think, I think we're good, actually. I think I did it. Is it done? All right, now we gotta go back down. I gotta find a way down, actually. 
Oh, oh, all sorts of lag. Oh, please, please. Oh, okay, I think we're fine. Are we okay? Yes, we are fine. Okay, guys, so that is friggin' done, actually. I didn't realize it was gonna be that quick. But uh, what's this? Oh, it's a spawner, okay. Uh, we'll drop down here now. And then, I believe, we just fall down here. Oh, yes! Would you freaking look at that? It is working. It is working. Now, this thing really isn't big at all. It's freaking tiny, actually. I plan on making an AFK pool probably closer to the spawners because, uh, well, I don't know if it makes a difference or anything, but uh, I want it to make a difference. <laughs> now, with this final sign, we have to do something that we haven't done in here yet, and that is... Banana. Nope, I spelled that wrong. Cell. Head. Army. Oh, yes. And then we go in here, grab our first few heads. Look at that, would you? Look at that. All right. And then, kaboom! All right. Friggin' awesome, guys. So, uh, I don't know how long this episode's been, actually. It's probably really not been that long at all. I am super sorry if this is like eight minutes. I, I, <laughs> I will try my best to find some, uh, find some filler or something like that, but I, I can't really think of what to do. Anyways, that is it for, uh, well, now, I guess. Because I don't really have much else to do here at the cow farm. I probably AFK and make a lot of money. So, <laughs> I don't know what we're going to do. But uh, this thing is working pretty well indeedy. Uh, not sure why that split up, but whatever. Anyways, guys, my name is Josh. And uh, I will see you in the next bit. So, thanks for watching so far. And I'll see you then. Uh, body Jack. <laughs> Alright, guys. So, uh, I have a little bit of an extra thing right now to do. Mr. Alligator20 over here. Friggin' awesome dude. Uh, he came up to me and he said, Hey, man. I want to give you a raid right now. So, uh, I thought, yeah, let's friggin' do this. Oh, my. Okay. <laughs> dude, that's such a cool skin. When you look up, it uh, it opens your... It opens, oh, no. <laughs> dude, that is so friggin' awesome. Alright, so uh, he told me that the sporters are gone. So, uh, I guess there's a couple chests here. Uh, this one's empty. Ooh, a stack of obsidian and a chicken spawner. Dude, two freaking hoppers. All right, this is good. <laughs> Dude, I will take this. A couple night bows. Ah, uh, yes, freaking happy about that. Okay, uh, ooh, prop three, yes. Uh, oh, I don't have any inventory space. No. <laughs> I gotta tell, I gotta tell Buddy Jack that I said his name. All right, so, uh... <laughs> oh. <laughs> I gotta tell him that I'm recording. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. All right, so, uh, yeah, like I said before, I think all the spawners got taken, but there was still some good loot in those chests, so I'm pretty freaking happy about that. That is a nice way to, uh, to finish off <laughs> the sign as well. The freaking sign as well. Would you look at that? Mr. Alligator, I love it. Banana army for the win. Yes, that is true. Banana army's pretty awesome. Now, this cell head sign is not right. Should have said banana. Sell. Head. Army. <laughs> Alright, sweet! So, uh, I guess we're gonna go back to, uh, home farm. And I will start dropping some of this stuff off. Okay! Seem to have set my home like an idiot. Um, I'm gonna have to do some James Bond stuff here. Nope, I just opened the chest. That was definitely not James Bond-esque in any way. <laughs> Alright, let's drop this! Come on, please! Just let me place it! Alright, there we go. Really? Really? Get out of the way, cows, please. Oh! <laughs> if this goes into the hopper, I'm gonna be so sad. What? Nope! <laughs> Gosh darn it! Alright, we're gonna have to go back in here. There it is, the friggin' okay. We're going back up. We're going back up. Please! Dude, get out of the way. Just move, and then let me plug. Yes! Finally! Alright, so, back to the dump chests. We gotta get all this stuff away. Just uh, throw it in here. This is unclaimed, by the way, just to point out. So, at the moment, pretty secluded area. I don't think anybody's going to find this for a while. So, we should be good. We should be good. Anyways, slash TP accept. We will go back to the raid and collect some more stuff. See, I've been getting lagged out a lot recently. I, I don't think it's Psycho. I'm 100% sure it's me. But, uh, I don't know why. I think there's something to do with my PC or something's broken. But, all right, back to home... F Ooh, I like it. I like it. Freaking love that, man. When we got inside it, we lost every bit of armor. That includes... We lost all the armor. All the iron armor, all the weekly armor, daily armor. Everything's gone. So, um, I still have, like, a couple sets of Prop 4 in my E-chest. But other than that, we are running definitely pretty low. So, this is a good boost, man. As you know, last time someone did something good for the faction, we, uh, we invited them. And so, uh, 
you want an invite. I'm going to ask him. So, here we go. We could be about to get a new member right here. I'm going to throw him a gap just to, uh, just to hopefully... Okay. Here we go, guys. We're about to get a new member. So, Mr. Alligator. F invite. Here we friggin' go. I'm ready to put GG in the chat. Here we friggin' go. Here we go. And... Yeah, friggin' oh, awesome. G friggin' G, man. G friggin' G. And welcome to the Banana Army. So, like I said earlier on in the episode, the uh, recruitment thread will be going up at some point soon. I just don't know when that's going to happen. But uh, that's pretty much it for today's episode. I guess we'll end it off while we're doing this uh, while we're doing this outro. We've got pretty much everything going here. Thank you so friggin' much to Alligator. I appreciate your kindness so much. Thank you so much for the raid, dude. Huge shout-outs. You're an awesome guy. I am sorry to Mr. Sorb OP. Let's find out. S slash F who Sorb OP. I wonder. I wonder if this guy, see, this was made a month ago. No. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I just raided, I just raided Beto. <laughs> I just raided someone in Beto's faction. I'm sorry, Beto, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, everyone. I didn't mean to. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm sorry, Empress. I mean, they took the spawn, as I assume. So, there was just, I guess, I wouldn't say junk, because there was good stuff left here, but. <laughs> oh, Josh, you silly guy. Should have should have checked that. But this was made a month ago, so I, I, I guess it's not so bad. <laughs> we freaking raided the yellow ship. No, it's so terrible. All right. My name is Josh. Thank you so much for watching today's video. GG to Mr. Z Z Zed Snipes, who just bought friggin' Night Rank here on Psycho. Talking to Psycho, you can come and join me on the server here. IP is play.psychopvp.com. Of course, it'll be in the description and in the top right corner of the video. But with that, shout out to my man Alligator. Shout out to everybody else. Oh, oh, we're gonna do this. We're gonna pull a Mitch right now, baby. That is what we're gonna do. I, except I don't have a fiber. Uh, excuse me? Huh? Don't have fiber. I'm going up these stairs. I am going all the way up these stairs. Yes, I am indeed. And apparently I can't eat this. Oh, 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 oh! The TNT flew through the... <laughs> Roll the slow motion, Josh. The, the friggin' TNT. Oh, oh. It's gonna be a fall. Whoop! Run! Okay, this place, blown to smithereens. I'm sorry, Empress, but I, I, I assume... This was an old base. It's done. Now, we're going to watch out, because I don't want to get blown up, but I think it would be hilarious. So, <laughs> if it happens, I won't be too salty. Anyways, dude, that is enough rambling from me. Shout out to everybody who was kind enough. Also, Jimmy OG, i got to give you a shout out, man. He gave me some items. Shout out to Jackie. Shout out to everybody who has given me the insane amount of support recently. We're gaining like 10 subscribers a day. This is something that has never happened to me. Um, probably... This was my second best month of my entire time doing YouTube. I've had this channel for like four years now, guys. This was the best month. So thank you. Thank you to Otekas. Thank you to Psycho. Thank you to every single one of you that hits the like button, comes back, watch the videos, etc. I'm glad I can uh, brighten some of you guys' days. That is freaking awesome. Anyways, with that, my name is Josh. Uh, uh, we're not going to do a secret word of the day, but we are going to go for 100 likes on this episode. And I know we can do it, because we're pretty much on 100 on every single other episode. 150 likes on the first one, man. That's insane. Anyways, this outro has been way too long. So, my name is Josh. Thank you for watching. You can join the Banana Army today by hitting subscribe. But with that, I will see you, well, in the next episode, which will be out tomorrow, because... <laughs> Hashtag Banana Army Appreciation Month!